good guys welcome back we're out here in the Foz we're on a bit of a little overland camping mission check out the view so yeah the goal of today is to find a camping spot um, we're out here solo overlanding so no pop tires no getting bogged you know the usual because um, yeah no help no phone service so yeah we only have ourselves to keep us out of danger uh, we've come across this We've come across this campsite. First one we've come across, not too bad. But I feel like there's a better one out there. So yeah, so let's get back into it and let's get out there. Stumbled across another campsite. Check it out. Not too bad. But I still feel like we can get a better one. So let's continue. All right. So this is actually the best campsite we've found so far. Check it out. It's a beautiful zoo. Check this out. You got like a little chair down here, a little place to chill. Not too bad. I don't like to fall off the edge. All right, so this spot is actually really good. Um, it's still a bit early in the day, so I don't really want to stop here. We'll definitely mark this on the map, and this might be where we're staying tonight. Just check that out. So perfect. Wow. It's almost perfect. We're going to check out one more spot. Um, well, there might be a few more spots along the way, but yeah, we actually, we really might be back here. All right, let's continue. Let's get out of here. here but I don't think it's anything we can't conquer so um, let's check the depth and see what's going on all right this is a pretty good stick yeah actually perfect stick so we're just going to use this look at that perfect we're just going to use this to check the depth um, make sure that we're not going to get too stuck. Um, also, don't want to get attacked by leeches or snakes. So we got to be careful out here. All right. So really shallow. And we're going to be all right. to use the puddle stick again because we have an even bigger puddle this time I'm a little worried about this one just a little bit because it looking it looks pretty deep but let's get the stick find out like we saved it and fingers crossed because yeah if anything goes wrong we're kind of screwed but good thing nothing's gonna go wrong here we go be easy to get up here Ooh. Oh, that goes kind of deep. Definitely not going to the center.
that one a little fast. But I think it's all right. All right, if we encounter one more puddle like that, I feel like we might be pushing our luck. Um, hopefully there's no more. I hope there's no rain tomorrow because looking back, it doesn't look as easy going out as it was coming in, which could be a problem. But we'll deal with that when we get there. All right, so unfortunately, the track got a little too difficult down there. Um, could probably do it with someone, but by myself, not willing to risk it. So I had to turn around, which was a little risky, but did it. And guess where we are again? Back at our favorite puddle. So we're here at the campsite we found earlier. Beautiful view, no complaints. So yeah, it's time to set up camp, get the car ready for sleeping, chop up some firewood, and get ready to enjoy a beautiful sunset. And we're eating good tonight. T-bone steak, so we're definitely excited for that. But until then, just gonna kick back, have a drink, just chill. Taking the sights, the sounds, doesn't get much better than this. Busy living the dream. All right, I just noticed my toe was bleeding like a mother And guess who the culprit is? That nasty thing. All right, so it looked like, it was looking like it was gonna be a nice sunset. But some clouds moved in, so I'm gonna get the drone up real quick, show you guys where we are. Um, and still, fingers crossed, hopefully there's a good sunset, but yeah, here comes the drone shots. Whoop. It's time to make a little fire pit, cut up some wood, and get ready for a nice night. Here we go. We got the fire going, now it's time to get dinner going. And while that's cooking, I'm gonna show you guys the sleeping arrangements. So I have a special air mattress that fits perfectly in the back of SUVs. So it kind of has like the wheel well arches cut out. Covers the whole back. Uh, it's just about perfect. If I lay a little bit diagonally, it, uh, it's enough room. But then look at this. That's what we're going to wake up to. Don't forget guys, smash that like button and uh, hit me with a little subscribe. It really helps out the channel and it's free to do. So hook your boy up. All right, I'm just going to chow down, eating good tonight. 
And I think I'll just see you guys in the morning. If anything exciting happens, you guys will be the first to know. But for the rest of the night, I'll probably just be relaxing and chilling. So until the morning, guys. See ya. Good morning, bright and early. Check out what I just woke up to. Wow. Make sure I don't fall off this cliff. I'm still a bit in the sleepy days. <laughs> oh, but yeah, check that out. Doesn't get much better than that. In a few minutes, I'll get the drone up in the air. Get some cool shots for you guys. So yeah, I'll see you guys then. Here we go. beautiful view and now it's time for coffee so barista sessions it is hope you guys are ready not getting super fancy just freeze-dried coffee but it does the trick just gonna let that boil up a little bit fire's going strong we got the view oh, I don't know if you guys can see it way off in the distance there's some hot air balloons. We got the same view as they do. All right, I need a spoon. And I'll show you guys the secret to a barista coffee in the bush in just a second. Let that warm up just a bit. Make sure there's no bugs in there. Instead of just adding cold milk to your coffee, we're gonna heat it up. So it's kind of like, almost like froth milk, but without the froth. <laughs> so I guess not really like froth milk, but it's warm and it's creamy and it's delicious. So let's get into it. And we just want this to simmer. We don't want it to burn. Yeah, definitely excited for this coffee. Much needed. Should be ready soon. Very, very soon. Oh, I probably look so tired right now. Ooh, the car camp wasn't the best sleeping. Um, I think the air mattress was just a little too full. So it's just, yeah, a bit awkward, but we made it for sunrise, so no worries. All right, so I'm a bit addicted, so we're gonna have one more coffee and then we'll go hit up another trail, see what we can find. Um, try not to get bogged, try not to get stuck, try not to break anything. But yeah, all in the good name of exploring. Got another coffee on the boil. Fire is starting to go out. We'll have one more coffee and then we'll pack up and get exploring. You guys ready? Here we go. All right, so we found a little challenge for the old girl. Let's see if we can do it. It's a bit steep. Yeah, we'll put that all-wheel drive system to the test. Here is where I tried to approach as slow as possible.
All right, so I just realized that the track we just came down is a dead end. So that means we have to go back up this sketchy trail. Uh, it's a bit leafy, so a bit slippery. I haven't aired down the tires yet, so I might have to do that. But we'll give it a go um, without doing that first. And hopefully we can get out of here because we're kind of in the middle of nowhere. No phone reception. So if we get stuck, we're kind of fucked. But that's all right, because we got it. Old Halle Berry is a fucking beast. Cross your fingers, guys. Look at that, stressed for no reason. Sometimes I gotta have a little more faith in the falls. But yeah, she did all right, easy. Let's see what else we can find. Right now we're looking for a good spot to post up and make some late breakfast, early lunch. So hopefully we find somewhere to view, and just a real nice tranquil spot. But until then, let's keep exploring. Oh, we just came across a huge snake. Almost ran it over. But damn, it's huge. It's maybe a meter and a half long. But I don't think that it's poisonous. I think it's just a tree python. So yeah, it's green, so you know it's all right. It's the brown ones and the black ones you gotta look out for. Ooh, that didn't sound too good. You know what I mean. We found a nice little spot to make some lunch. Lunch with a view. All right, so let's get cooking. Welcome to the kitchen. Let's get it started. God oh, damn. I was like, hmm, we're definitely missing something. Little avocado tried to run away. Silly, silly. Look at this. Clog my fing arteries and call me daddy. That's what I'm talking about. All right. So when people talk about living the dream, this is what they're talking about. So I think that's about it for today, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it just as much as I did. Um, don't forget to hit that like, that subscribe button down below. Hit that bell notification so you guys never miss a video. Because, yeah, I'm sure you guys don't want to miss another video like this. Um, yeah, until next time, guys, take it easy.